Hello, everyone. Today we will talk about uh, Buddhism. Uh, uh, you may already read my PowerPoint um, in slide seventeen. The emperor has a conversation with um, Bodhidharma. Okay, and the. This conversation is really, really hard to understand if you don't know the backgrounds. Uh, so today, I will talk about this um, conversation first. All right, I would like to read uh, this conversation first. Uh, the emperor said, uh, How much karmic merit have I earned for ordaining Buddhist monks Building monasteries, having statues copied, and commissioning Buddha images. Um, Bodhi Dharma Dharma said, "Nang, good deeds done with a worldly intent bring good karma, but no merit." The emperor said, "So, what is the highest meaning of for?" Noble truths. Uh, Bodhi Dharma said, "There's no noble truths. There is only emptiness." The emperor said, "Then who is standing before me?" Uh, Bodhi Sava said, "Bodhi Dharma said, uh, 'I don't know, Your Majesty.'" It's very interesting conversation, but it's really, really hard to understand. In order to understand this conversation, we have to know who is the emperor, right?、Uh, the emperor is uh, uh, the Emperor Wu of a、uh, Liang Dynasty. Okay, Liang Dynasty is very short dynasty. So, but uh, uh, this emperor. Um, believes、uh, Buddhism、uh, very much, and、uh, start from him. He encouraged a lot of young men to be monks.、Um, so he built a lot of、um, um, temples, Buddhist temples.、Uh, also,、uh, he start from him. He just、uh, um, asked the monks not eat meat. Before the monks could eat meat, but、uh, um, you know, after that, after him,、um, you know, monks won't eat meat. They they are they becomes vegetarian, and because they believes you know, they they're not killing, killing any animals. So, so this is the emperor. Okay, he did a lot of things for Buddhism to spread spread of the Buddhism. Um, and uh, uh, Bodhidharma. Who is Bodhidharma? Bodhidharma is a monk. Is Indian monk,、um, and、uh, he is the founder of、uh, Chan Buddhism or Zen Buddhism.、Um, you know, it's a, a school of a Buddhism. So. Chan Buddhism or Zen Buddhism is a, is the same thing.、Uh, in China, they call it Chan Buddhism. In Japan, they call it Zen Buddhism.、Um, it's a school of、uh, Buddhism. So he he is the founder of、uh, Chan or Zen Buddhism.、Uh, so they have the conversation. This conversation is about karmic. Okay,、uh, karmic. So if you did good thing, you got good, you know,、uh, result. And if you did a bad thing, you you get punished, you know, by the, you know, the god, <laughs> whatever, <laughs> right?、Uh, so in this conversation, the emperor was showed off what I did. See, I encouraged a lot of young men to become monks and. Uh, uh, I did a lot of things for、uh, spread of a Buddhism, and your monks all depend on me, right? And I did a lot of good things for Buddhism. So the emperor believed that's a merit, and that's、uh, you know exactly. He's very proud of his, himself, 
right? Uh, but uh, uh, the Bodhidharma said, you know, good, yes, good deeds done. Uh, that's for sure. But uh, bring good karma, but no merit. So Bodhidharma, uh, Bertie, uh, he believes what's the goal of uh, uh, practicing Buddhism, become Buddha, right? Become enlightened people, right? So a Buddha is an enlightened people, right? And uh, even though the emperor did a lot of things, but uh, he's, you know, um, he believes if you do everything sincerely, uh, you should forget what you did. It's not like the emperor always remember what he did, right? Uh, you should forget what I what he did, and um, so um, you just uh, benefit just like water. Like before we talk about Taoism, like a water uh, benefit everything, but not compete with everything. Uh, so um, that's Bodhi uh, Bodhi Dharma's thoughts. Right, um, so you don't have the thoughts thinking about um, your benefit anybody, right? You are do you are you do well. You're proud. You don't need to have all this kind of uh, um, thoughts. You know, if you don't have a this kind of thoughts, just do things naturally. You know, just do whatever you think is right to do. Um, well. Uh, that called the real Chan or real Zen, okay? Uh, that's a uh, uh, body armor's thoughts. Bodhi Dharma is a very very interesting figure. Uh, he not only the founder of uh, uh, Chan or Zen Buddhism, also the founder of uh, Shaolin Kung Fu. Uh, you know, um, he was uh, facing the, he was uh, live in a cave, uh, uh, you know, um, for like nine years. Uh, around the cave, they built a temple, uh, this temple called the Shaolin Mountain, uh, Sha uh, Shaolin Temple, I'm sorry, uh, Shaolin Temple. And uh, this temple right now is in Sun Mountain. Uh, it's a very famous mountain in China. Uh, so uh, he also was the founder of uh, uh, Shaolin Kung Fu, right? Um, by legend, um, he was uh, walking, he was uh, like uh, hiking, and he met a river, a uh, very um, big river. Um, he want to cross the river, but uh, no boats, yeah. He just pick one leaves and put leaf on the river, and he stand on the leaf, uh, cross the river. You know, there are a lot of legend uh, about him. So I encourage you to do some research on karma, on merit, on the emperor Wu and of Liang, uh, also. Uh, like uh, um, body dharma, so uh, also like story about the Shaolin Temple. There are a lot of story. Every dynasties, there are some story about the Shaolin Temple. Uh, also the philosophies and the concepts of Buddhism. Okay, just do some research for extra credit. Um, so, all right. See you next time.